So throughout your life, um, doesn't matter how positive you are, we're going to face uh, challenges. We're going to have times where we have uh, people who are negative around us, uh, whether it's in our business, whether it's over relationships, and sometimes uh, within our, our family members. And you may have faced this before. I mean, it doesn't matter. I travel the world. I speak all on the topic of motivation and positivity. But let me tell you something. Sometimes it's the closest people to you that for some reason you just can't get through to. And they're all being negative about stuff. Some people are so negative, they can find a negative, they can find a problem to every single solution um, you give them. Have you ever had that before? <laughs> I know Dan's had that before. <laughs> a lot of the time, you know. Um, the thing is, there are certain ways to actually prevent yourself from absorbing these negative energies. And it's so important, because especially if the people you care for and you love and you can't just like get rid of them. Like you got to hang around with these guys. Like how do you keep yourself in that positive vibration? So what I want to share with you today is like how I do it. And especially in this environment, when I'm running events like this with like so many people literally back to back all around the world, you're going to have some people who always give you all the buts and ifs and you know, this can't work, that can't work. So the question is, how do we get rid of all of that? Now, what I do and what I, what I tend to do is this, um, a lot of the time, because those of you who have watched my other videos, you'll see that when it comes to eyes, it's our most sensitive part. So what does that mean? It means that when we, the moment we look into a negative person's eyes, right? That's when we start absorbing those negative energies. So what am I saying here? I'm saying you don't directly look into the eyes. That's number one. Okay. Those of you who are used to my videos, I want to type, type that below. Uh, those of you who are new to the, my videos, uh, we always type the learnings below because that reaffirms the learning on a subconscious level. Yeah. So type the first thing. First thing, right, is protect our eyes. So what this means is, let's say for example, um, if I'm having a conversation with Dan right now, or if I'm having a, having a conversation with you guys, I would just be um, looking um, like I can still I can still speak to you like this, right? doesn't have to be too intense. There's something called a three second rule when it comes to eye energy transfer. That's why a lot of people, they watch my eye energy transfer meditation videos. You start understanding that the moment it hits three seconds, that's when the connection happens. So how do we stop that from happening? We don't allow ourselves to push past those three seconds. So what do we do instead? One, two, look away. One, two, look away and talk. Once you look away and talk, and actually you don't always have to look away because it could be that you just do this, right? Let's say these two are two beams. Instead of focusing the two beams on their eyeballs, it's just focusing it so it's more distributed. So for example, this is a more intense looking directly and deep into your eyes right now, right? This is still looking at you, but not so deep and not directly in your eyes. This is when I know the connection. I won't be absorbing of those negative energies, okay? And then another thing is, um, when it comes to breathing, so eyes and breathing, these two things alone will be able to help you. So those, those of you who are typing below, type below. Number two, breathing, breath. So we can use this particular breathing method to actually stop absorbing all the negativity. So what, what is it and how does it work, right? Very simple. So let's say you have somebody who's giving you all this shit and all this negativity beside you, okay? So what we do is we focus on the breath out, not on the breath in. Now you're probably thinking, Eric, how can you breathe out but not in? Okay, I'm not saying breathe out but not in. We, you, we are doing both breaths. But the thing is, the um, breath in is organic. It's natural without you thinking about it. So without you wanting to breathe in, you're going to breathe in anyway. Then you focus on the out, which looks and sounds a little bit like this. But obviously, when you're speaking to people, you don't want to be going, <laughs> right? Because they're going to be like, what's, what's this person doing, right? Oh, I'm just protecting and trying to protect myself from your negative energy, right? So you don't need to do it like that. You do it very gently. So it's like a... And you can smile while doing it. They can be speaking to you. And you can continue the conversation. Yeah, okay, so, so, all right. So what else has happened in your life so far? You know, they speak, they speak, and you... Okay. 
right? And you just focus on breath, breath out because what happens whenever you breathe out is your aura, this protection field, it expands and it pushes against these other energies that are trying to get in. So if these two things alone, number one, remember, when we look, we don't need to look direct like this. The moment I do this, it's transfer, right? Whether it's anger, whether it's frustration, whether it's joy and love and peace right now, you'll feel it the moment you look deep into my eyes. But I can look at you in the same way or sometimes look away just to disrupt the pattern a little bit. And when I do that, I'm controlling and protecting the energy so I'm not absorbing all the negativity, right? The second thing is breathing. Breath is everything, remember. Second thing, <laughs> okay, let them speak. Okay, yeah, cool. You don't need to breathe out too loud because then it becomes uh, like, what are you doing? So keep it a little bit discreet. The more you practice it, the better you become. But these two things alone will save your life. That's why I'm able to hang around with thousands and thousands of people all the time, and it's okay. I don't get affected by anybody else's energy, and I'm still in my high vibrational energy of love, joy, and peace. Guys, if you found this video useful at all, please do hit the thumbs up, hit the like button. Also, comment below. Let us know your thoughts and let us know your experience of it all. It's always nice to know. And finally, if you're new to this channel, remember, remember to hit that subscribe button and the notifications button next to it because this year I'm dedicated to making daily videos to hold you accountable, to make it your best year yet. But for now, guys, <laughs> ciao. <laughs>